Generic greetings and welcome back to Nimbatus. In the previous episode we had a barrel problem and in order to rectify that we made the GD pickup drone which is better than the other ones in terms of power, not in terms of um, probably usability because it's still got magnets there which is pulling all of the parts towards it but hey ho it's got a lot more engines so it should be able to uh, thrust and pick stuff up. It's got the magnets on either side to grab the barrels and then we've got a lot more fuel as well so let's just go to launch and let's see how we get on with this one now the problem with this design is that obviously the fuel is on the outside so if that ever gets hit it's going to blow up which is definitely classed as suboptimal so we're going to turn these on and uh, we're going to blow that barrel up specifically so it uh, does a bit of splash damage going to head towards this drone here and then that should be now destroyed there we are remember we've got left click as just activate all of the guns and everything so we just want to get as close as we can to destroy that and then turn it off immediately because we really don't want to be hitting this thing and ah there you go look you can see we've actually uh, managed to pick that up that's great and we can now maneuver because we have the thrusting power what I'm having to do though is make sure I go go nowhere near the space bar because the space bar will fire weapons and yes it is possible to ooh, good grief it is possible to um, hit this barrel while you're carrying it and that's um, not great so let's just dump that there it should just gently roll in come on there we go, and that'll be one barrel for us. Uh, oh no, it didn't. It didn't. No, because that closes right. That because that closed <laughs> when we moved off. It didn't drop in. So there's one of them there. That's good. We'll uh, scoot past this thing here. I'm gonna. Um, ooh, I really want to fire a little bit just to get uh, just to get some more stuff. But uh, no, we're just gonna have to go that way. Um, are we? Why are we stuck on something again? Hang on, this happened before where it just wouldn't, it wouldn't go, Oh, it's happened again. <laughs> Alright, um, let's, yeah, I think we are actually, I think the magnet's actually pulling on the ground, which is not good. Um, we can probably just, probably just scoot it this way. There we go, there we go. I mean, there's a little bit of a scraping issue, but, um, there we go. It seems to get caught on the back and I don't know why. Either way, well, this is efficient. Let's go there. Ooh, don't put the big barrel next to the <laughs> next to the thruster that is almost certainly on fire. And there we go. So there's two barrels. A lot more efficient than previous attempts. So let's keep on going and we will probably destroy some more barrels here. But we'll do our best to uh, avoid such things. Um, well, we did manage to not destroy this barrel but the problem is that we've lost half the front um that's not great but we have got this barrel so that's going to be our number three and then there's another one on the left there as well so hopefully if we just dump that in there there we are spin you around and then head this way i have lost what have i lost so far i've lost a shield generator i've lost a battery and I've lost all of the guns on the front which is the or most of the guns on the front which is the main issue however this should be a easy pickup there we go and we can just use the full force of our uh, two four six eight engines it's got a flat eight engine and we'll just gently flick that in there oh nothing but net <laughs> oh for god <laughs> It, uh, yes, it might have got trapped between the doors. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. Keep going. So, we've got one more barrel to take, but the problem is that we've got very little... We've got very little firepower now. And indeed, oh, and indeed defense. And if we lose all of that, then obviously we are all kinds of screwed. Uh, do we want to risk going this way? I think if we just put our shields that way, we should be all right. You see the shield absorbing the impact quite nicely there. That was that was okay, and oh, we're not going that way. There's at least two turrets plus one of the uh, one of the sensory things, and there's no way I'm going to attempt that one at this stage with only one more barrel remaining. I'm not going to attempt that. So we're going to go the other way, all the way around, and now uh, we'll head towards the right, which hopefully we'll get onto a a better station. Now, the thing is, the the turrets and the sensor array type thing 
the aerial, whatever you would like to call it. Um, I believe you only get one of those on each planet, or at least at this stage. And uh, so there's a barrel, and oh, there's two barrels, and um, we just got one of these turrets. So this is actually fairly all right then. So you can see we're overheating it, and we've now got that, and this should be just heading away. Right, excellent. That is good. That should be that mission completed. Now, obviously, it's not all about just completing the missions. Um, it is about, you know, getting some of the resources and things like that as well. But uh, there we go. We have completed that. Click uh, metallic bio barrels. Excellent. So that is, that's given us, that's given us three, three stars. We've got this one here, which is the snake, I believe, again. Uh, medium level, destroy snake egg. Should we try our uh, GD2 and see if this can function? Um... Go on. Let's see if we can get it done. We don't need to do this because we obviously have um, enough to, to move to the next mission. But let's just see if we can. That's a new target. I don't know what that was. Uh, it's some sort of moth creature. And... Yeah. It, um, we've already taken some damage. But let's get, let's get the eggs. Remember, we're going for a speed run with these things. If you attack one, you just have to keep moving. Yeah, it's some sort of hive, like some sort of moth thing. Looks like they blow up as well, which is why we, uh, I believe, took some damage on the side there. I heard a, a roar, which means... Big one there. Whoa! Hell's bells. Right, so these are... Not good. Okay. Uh, oh, we've gone... Right, we've gone... Fun... <laughs> fun physics mode. Where the uh, all the parts trying to repel each other and in Genu you would class that as a uh, as a problem. Uh, <laughs> it's a feature in this game. It's a feature. They just say, yeah, it's, it's not going to work properly when it happens that. Uh, right. So we're going to try again. Um, we're going to need more long range weapons, I think, in order to do this. Or we have to engage them at a longer range. There's an egg. That's good. Very easy to deal with. The problem is these things, these moth type creatures. You really have to engage them at silly range. Oh, that's all kinds of bad. Right, I'm inside its turn and circle now. Right, just stay here. Just stay here. Just stay here. Okay, it's like snake. It is it is just like the game snake. Right, um, I am I'm now trapped inside this thing. Okay, more thrusters just power through, turn the shields on, and ooh, I don't think we lost many parts. Oh god, am I am I quicker than it? Okay. Do a Yui. <laughs> Do a 180 and head the other way. Right. Cool down a bit. There we are. Did we lose any parts? I don't think we did. It's still about though, it's still about. Um, drones is not something I really wanted to find on my travels, but I mean, when do I ever get what I want? There we go. There's them gone, and there's that gone. Not yet. Now it's gone. Okay. On oh, more turrets as well. The shield generator on that side here, on the left hand side, was hurt quite a bit. I can hear that thing again. Good grief, the explosion damage on them, the, 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 just the size of it is massive. That's problematic. The damage it causes is insane. Uh, we've only got two of the snake eggs so far, there's the third. I'm um, just firing at long range with these missiles and just hope, hoping that the bombardment hits in the right area. That's a big snake again, big snake, oh no, right, this way, all the way, all the way, all the way. right, just bail, bail, bail. Feels a bit sluggish now for some reason. Um, oh, that's because we've lost loads of thrusters. Right, okay. Oh, no, we're going to get eaten. We're going to get eaten again. Yeah, there's um, <laughs> there's that one gone. Okay. I think that's us there. Leave the planet. We're not coming back to this place. It is a horrible place. Definitely don't take the kids there on the weekend. So, we can travel to a new planet. And I think we will go to... Where do you want to go to? We'll try this one. 
Um, this will probably be a harder mission, but let's see. Oh yes, risk level is hard. Collect metallic buy or barrels. Um, is this going to be... Is this just going to be the same as what we've seen? I think it might be. Let's see, anyway. So I'm going to head down here, and... Whoa, the uh, gravity is not as problematic. So why is it a hard mission? What's around here? Nothing in there. Got a lot of undulating terrain here. Oh, well, that's a that's a problem if the barrel's on top of that. I'm not going to be able to pick that up, am I? We'll have, a, we'll have a scout out. We'll see what we can see. I've already lost half my stuff, so I'm just going to... I'm going to abort that. I'm just going to abort that. Um, we're going to just run past it. There's another barrel barrel on top of that. Don't say all the bio barrels are stuck on top of... On meteors now. I hope all the bio barrels are not stuck on top of... Um, on top of those. There's a crate. Oh, go away, drones. There we go. Um, I tell you what, it's got catastrophic understeer. Yeah, alright, okay. So it looks like all of the... It looks like all of the barrels are next to stuff that shoots. Is there a way we can deal with that? Um... Well, we'd need more precise weapons and just get rid of these. That is that is a possibility. Um, and we could make longer range weapons. Okay, let's go to Weapons Workshop then. Um, actually, no, we need to go back to Editor first. Go back over. We need to duplicate the pickup. Um, this is the second pickup. I want to get rid of all the fuel barrels here because they're just ready to explode and kill everybody. Get rid of all of these, like that, and we need to think about things like range. So, what's the range on these blasters? Um, let's just put it in space. So, right. So you can see the, the there's terrible accuracy on that. So we can't use that. We cannot use that. We need a very precise beam to take them out. Burning laser, freezing laser, terraforming laser, and basic flamer. Well, let's go to weapons workshop and see if we can make anything in particular. So, let's go for something with a lot of range. So, accuracy, we need high, and uh, actually, where's long laser? Laser range is quite long. Short laser, right. So, we want that one there, and we want to change it to just standard combat ammunition. We want extra damage. Oh, hang on, that's wrong. <laughs> there we go. Uh, one for this, extra damage. And do we want extra digging? Not really. Um, I'd rather have. I'm assuming you can't get rid of. Uh, can you have that? And then can you have? Yes, you can have. Can you just have more damage? No, you can only have uh, one of each upgrade. Sadly. And we'll have re energy reduction. So that's um, renamed to Long Laser. Then back to Editor. And we'll get rid of all of these. Like that. We'll put Long Lasers in the front. Um, duplicate them. Right, let's try that. Well, those are neither long nor... Well, they are lazy, I guess. But, I mean, they're the same as the other one. That's not great. Um... They are they are identical, right? For range? I'm sure they are. Mm, anything else I can do to increase range? Rocket force, bullet spread, that's particle speed, particle gravity. Oh, we don't have any of the points for that. Mm, what's this one? Extra recoil, and then we get accuracy. And no, we don't want any of that. We want laser range. Ah, we haven't got any blue. If we had laser range, that'd be perfect. Oh well. 
so they're exactly the same range. Okay, great. So we've gained almost nothing from doing all of that. Apart from we've got some, we have got some um, upgrades in um, the. We have got we have got some upgrades to be fair. Okay, right. Um, so space. There we go. And we'll change all these. So we'll toggle it. We have got some upgrades on it, so at least going to do more damage, and then hopefully when we get close, we'll just laser them. Laser the bits we need, so test flight. There we go, and it does drain the battery quite a bit, but we knew that that was going to be the case. We've taken all of the combustibles on the, off the outside. I mean, we could start cladding it in armour, and have this as a fairly armoured thing. It is a possibility. Like that. It will make it heavier. Somewhat heavier, in fact. Um, I'm going to duplicate that, and then we connect it to that, and then we click it there. You can see how quick it is to, to do something like that. And we'll sort of arm the shoulders up. There we go. Okay, test flight. It's a lot... Yeah, it's, it's sluggy, but it's not too bad. Okay, we'll, we'll go with that. We'll go with that. Save and exit. That's the GD Pickup 2. We will launch. So we have to take out the... The drones and indeed the turrets, but you know, using a precise matter of crashing into things, a precise method. So let's just head that way. Um, whoa, hang on. Oh yeah, we ran out of fuel. Right, there is a there is still a fuel problem. That's going to be far too uh, prohibitive. Um, leave the planet. Um, select the drone. Edit that. What we'll do is we'll pull this shoulder up to there. And then we'll put in some more fuel. Um, we'll connect the fuel to. It doesn't really matter too much. Duplicate there, duplicate there, duplicate there. Um, actually, not. Connect that to that. Connect that to that. Connect that to that. Duplicate that. Connect it to. Uh, where was it? That connected to. There we go. There we are. Right. Save and exit. Hopefully that's a bit better. Launch. So. It's similar. In oh, look at that. It's all wobbling around now. <laughs> Whoa, hang on. Straight away. That's good. That's good. Excellent. That's exactly what we wanted. Right, so. We just thrust up. And I really need a toggle on this magnet. <laughs> Sadly, I do not have one. One barrel. Okay, good. That was exactly what I was looking for, which means that something is about to go hideously wrong in about 25 milliseconds. So I believe there was a lot of turrets around here. Yeah, there was. There was. Um, I'm going to angle it like this, just so the, the other turret doesn't fire. There we go. Um, I'm stuck again. Come on. Thrust the other way. Come on, you big piece of space lead. Move! There we go. Yeah, we've lost some weapons now. Right. Thrust the other way. Come on! There we are. Right, we've lost... Magnet. I mean, it very easily takes that stuff out, doesn't it? See what I mean? It just doesn't thrust that way. It just doesn't want to thrust. It seems to get stuck on things. So, is there another barrel around here? Oh, there is a barrel around here. There's two barrels, actually. Um, the question is, can I carry both? Um, actually, no. The question is, do I want to try and carry both? Uh, the answer is yes, I really do want to try and carry both. So I'll just give this a little cheeky tap the other way. Come on! <laughs> right, so they're now together. I will back up, and then the magnet should be able to pick up both. We'll just rest on them here, because that's totally safe. Perfect, good, 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 right. I'll be honest, the main reason I wanted to pick them both up is because, quite frankly, I really couldn't be bothered to come back all this way. Although, I am going to have to come back this way to get the other stuff. Actually, I might go the other way. We'll try that way. 
Um, so that is going to be barrel uh, three five. That's good. And drop those off. Perfect. And now we have to see what's this side. We know that the main drone uh, center uh, is be has been destroyed. And oh, we've also got one in here, which is going to be fun trying to back out of this. So we'll go forward. And we will magnetize that and back up. And oh, lovely. Absolutely lovely. And then we crunched on the ground. Side thrusters are not something that uh, this thing has that's of any use. <laughs> it just doesn't seem to uh, doesn't seem to want to use them properly. Or rather, I just don't think we've got enough. There we go. Oh, straight in. One more barrel. It's basically the space equivalent of like cleaning up the uh, the rainforest. So you can see. Very specific problems. Oh, for that's it. We can't do it. We can't do the mission. We've lost the magnet. Oh, so close yet so far. I mean, we were always against. We were always against the clock, really. When and uh, yeah, we we're always against it when we lost the the first set on the other side. That's a shame. So we'd have to come and redo this one. Um, what I'm probably going to do is we'll uh, leave that and we'll leave that there for now. Um, I'll go ahead and uh, I'll go ahead and do that outside of uh, recording, and um, we'll move on to uh, probably another planet. Or we might leave it there. I don't know. Uh, let us know what you think, and uh, we will go from there. We have progressed a one, two, and we can. Uh, oh, if we get that one done, which we will get uh, done, uh, we can progress on the next one. So we've got quite far actually, further than I thought. But um, yeah, harder things to uh, to come, and then you go on to next bits and stuff anyway, because it's only Galaxy One. <laughs> anyway, as always, hope you have enjoyed the video. Thanks very much for watching. Take care and generic partings. <laughs>